ordered breakfast from one of my favorite brunch spots. And it should be here. Happy hump day. Yeah, today's hump day. I hope everyone is doing well. I hope you all are enjoying, hopefully where you are is good, having good weather because today we are enjoying 76 degree weather. I think it's supposed to storm tonight, but right now in this present moment, the weather is amazing. I'm sitting with my windows up, my instinct going, and I hear the birds, and you know, I'm just thinking about like how much earth in the world has to offer for, for nothing. Like what you can experience outside of the things that you can buy that are so beautiful. And I'm just thinking about how I'm in such a season of change and growth and what that means for me. And it means a lot of things. Some things I know, some things I do not know. Um, I'm 29 and I feel like I'm just getting to a place of understanding and learning myself in a way that is going to benefit my future in a great way. Not that saying like everything I haven't learned up to now has not benefited my future because obviously it has. But, you know, I'm just learning some very hard lessons, discovering some things about myself, uncovering traumas and therapy. And it's definitely been a journey, a journey of self-love, a journey of self-acceptance, a journey of, you know, releasing my people-pleasing ways and actually tapping in, into what I want and not worrying so much about what other people think about me or how I'm perceived or anything like that. You know, I realized like so much of my life has been based on how other people per perceive me so that I could feel accepted or wanted with friends, family, relationships that I have ignored myself for so long. And it feels very weird. It feels very weird because I'm not used to putting myself first. Um, it feels weird to be stepping into this new energy, but I know it's an energy that's for me. Loving and accepting my body the way I am. Literally, the way I am. Like realizing there's nothing wrong with my body. It just may be bigger than it was, but literally there's nothing wrong with my body. My face, still the same. Like, I just have more it's not even more skin it's just more more me to love and it's like i'm okay with that i'm okay with that i'm okay with that because it's another one of those things it's like i'm in such a space of transition transitioning from my old clothes to new clothes that fit my new body transitioning from being a loose natural to a lock natural y'all i'm telling you the most interesting thing is I feel like my hair journey is definitely parallel to my life. Like patience, having to be patient and not in allowing what's going to be to be, even though you don't know what it's going to be. But it's like you just put yourself out there to accept it because that's what we're here to do. We're here to flow, not go against. And in flowing, you learn, you grow. And in going against, you suffer. You become depressed. You, you have bounds of anxiety and different things like that. So I just encourage anyone that's having a time of transition or time of growth. 
road to open yourself up. Go easy on you, like Adele said in the song. And know that it's okay. It is okay. We may not know the next step, but if you're brave enough to step, you will find your alignment when you let go and let your uh, when you let go and you let your intention be alignment your life will go where it's supposed to go we don't have to know the next step and i feel like we'll be more open to letting our life do what it's supposed to do if we stop looking at other people's life and saying like dang i wish i could do this and do that Y'all, I don't know how I can say, I, there's really no other way to say that your journey is your journey. Literally, your journey is your journey. And when you really sit and think about it, everything that you've ever been through, you've needed so bad. You've needed so bad. You wouldn't have got the lesson. You wouldn't have got the growth that you can look and say that you have now, if not for those lessons. 